you guys! <laughs> oh. Little music is nice. Hello everyone, welcome to Bagel Plays the Classics. We're gonna play an RPG. Um, you're gonna go to bed. Oh no, don't go to bed! What do you have to do tomorrow? It's Thursday. Just call out of work on Friday, whatever. And, but hey everyone, oh there's so much people in here. So fast. But hey, hey everyone, hey Esty Cowboy. But I can't even say hi to all of you guys, come on. It's <laughs> too many. How'd you all get here so fast? Hey, Big Al New York. And Hans Gruber Jr. The famous Hans Gruber Jr. <laughs> you told everyone. Well, thank you, Ricky, dude. I, honestly, I had no idea what I was going to stream up until like five minutes ago. Which actually doesn't usually end well. But come on, this game's like ten hours long. We'll beat it two times over. Whatever that means. So, <laughs> let's get this going. As fun as this remix is, I have to shut it off. I'm all about the video game remixes. If you don't know that about me. Um, doot doot doot. Oh yeah, I don't have anything, f any fancy transitions right now. That's okay. Where is it? There. Oh, there's the game. You're welcome, SD Cowboy. When am I gonna get a webcam, Bear? It's a good question. Answer's never. But you actually brought up something I want to talk about. On Sunday, I found out I live in a I live in a uh, a house like I rent the top floor of a house and my landlord lives on the my title's wrong I updated it like twice. And oh my god, I got the I even made sure I had the right apostrophe because bagels was possessive. And, oh, to screw up Anne on an ah. Uh. You know what it is? I had a, a, an RPG, and then I added time traveling in there. Because I was making a very vague joke with my title that no one's gonna get. But on Sunday, I live in a house. Someone at my door. No, I think that's just the wind. It's so hot! Like, straight up, it was like 95 degrees yesterday. Ugh. What's going on in the game? Like, spoiler alert game, what is this? just tell you what's gonna happen? Anywho. The game's very quiet for me. I think it's my own problem. Um... The heck was I talking about? Oh yeah, so I live in an apartment. Anyway, I came home and I, the other day and I found out my landlord is having a yard sale on Sunday. So I'm gonna live stream it in an event I'd like to call Bagel live streams to the landlord's yard sale. I don't know what time it starts at, because I haven't talked to the man about it. But I'm going to kind of creep around, watch him from the window. <laughs> and we're just going to see what happens. <laughs> That's not really me, also. Um, <laughs> we'll play a game, too. We'll play a game, too. <laughs> but I'm going to set up a webcam in a window, and we'll just watch the yard sale. <laughs> I had this idea last night. And it's probably a good one. <laughs> so be sure to tune in Sunday. Again, I don't know when. Th th these old people, they get up so early. So it's pr I probably going to have to set my alarm clock. It's actually a two-day yard sale. I really wish I could get the Saturday yard sale. But I have to work. Ugh. So tune in. But now, back to more immediate things. There it is. This game here. Zombor on the bridge. Now... He yeah, has a two-day event! He's got so much content to get rid of. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, we're gonna creep on him. And we'll play a game too, it's not just gonna be the, the yard sale. <laughs> I don't think I could hold the commentary. But we'll, you know, window and window it. Whatever. <laughs> I don't know, if we get enough views. <laughs> Maybe. I feel bad though, it's so hot out, I look like an idiot right now. I'm all sweaty. I have an AC, but my apartment's too big for the AC to cool the whole thing down. Oh, it's horrendous. Like, my legs are sweating right now. Like, my ankle is sweating right now. Let's get into this game. Yeah, this happens every time we try to play RPGs. Anyone who picks weight is a nub. You pick active. I was always confused by this. Active time battle version 2? Like, what does that mean? As a where was version 1? Like, is that a trademark? What are they talking about? 
It's like a mod for a game. Ver 2. I don't know about that. Oh, it's one of those one of those games where circle is yes. Oh, we get to name our characters, of course. One of you is delete. Oh, I just write over it, don't I? <laughs> Bro, no. <laughs> What if we played the game and we just changed everyone's character to start with the letter B? <laughs> Brodo, Bruka, <laughs> Brobo. Actually, it'd be Bobo. <laughs> Barl. Yeah, okay, that's what we're doing because all the names are hilarious. <laughs> Bagus. <laughs> Giant Bob. Di are you fucking kidding me? They did exactly that? No! Are you serious? So they had the same serendipitous moment where they went to start typing in a name, started with the letter B, and said, wait a minute, I'm done after one character. Are you serious? They already did this? Wait, no, I'm very distraught. Yeah, but it's a humid 95 degrees bear. It's not a dry heat. It's a it's a wet, moist heat. They did. Yeah, they did that. I, that is the most random idea. How? We'll name a bagel like I was going to. That was such a good. Oh man, this sets the mood for the whole night. I was riding that <laughs> that yard sale high. <laughs> now. <laughs> Yeah, how'd they pick B? That's so random! Ah, oh, crap. Crap. Should name I should name everyone just crap. Whatever. The reality of me having to voice act all the characters has just hit. It's always so daunting. At least Chrono doesn't talk. Oh wait! This game's hard, because every character's a chick. Uh Crap, Trigger. <laughs> I wonder what that game would be like. <laughs> yes, Bale's my favorite TV show. <laughs> One person got the reference. <laughs> Give him a girl's voice, too? I could. I can't believe they named everyone B! Was it- did they name it that because of, like, bro? Like, he was a bro? And Brog? Hey, Overlord Fate! Yeah, we're playing classics now. Not stupid, idiot, DayZ. Keep getting killed after three hours of work. We're not playing that game. That jerk game. Bagel! Bagel! Good morning, Bagel! It's my mom. It's my mom. Like, this is like RPG cliche number one. There's like... Every... I know, I like it too. <laughs> Come on, sleepyhead, get up! The other one is like... Oh no! There's a... Disaster in the town. Where... There's been a lot more monsters around than usual. It's your fault. Ah! Lean's Bell makes such a beautiful music. We're already screwing up, we just started. You were so excited about the Millennial Fair that you didn't sleep well, did you? I want you to behave yourself today. <laughs> Let's get moving now! Earthbound actually has two cliches. What with the waking up and with the um, disaster in the town. Golden Sun has a disaster in the town too. There's more I can't think of. All right, let's go. This game was revolutionary. It had a run button. Finally, by the way, that inventor friend of yours. Uh, you know, oh dear, I've forgotten her name. I would have liked to name her Bucca, but that ain't happening anymore. Golden Sun, oh. Uh. <laughs> Golden Sun is fun. I'm too stupid to play that game on stream, though. Fucka? Name her Bob. <laughs> That's confusing. Or do they always have the picture next to them, so I'll know. 
Because every time I name female characters, male characters... No, it's always the same. It's always you guys that get the names. <laughs> Put a number sign in there. Yeah, what? Wait, 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 wait. What if her name was like, quote, unquote? <laughs> yeah, now it has to be this. She's Bob, but she's like, ironically Bob. Quote unquote Bob. <laughs> she is the Ziggy of this, but we'll name her quote unquote Bob. Why would you give me quotes to work with? An ampersand? I've got five spaces and you're throwing an ampersand at me? I've got five characters to work with. <laughs> ampersand. Someone's name is just gonna be ampersand. Or like it'll be the letter H. And then an ampersand, we'll call him Hamper Stand. <laughs> Don't forget to tune in this Sunday to Bagel Livestream as Landlord's Yard Sale. Okay. <laughs> play the game. <laughs> That's right, Bob. Don't forget that she invited you to see her new invention. <laughs> Run along now, and be back before dinner. Yeah, we're having a yard sale. <laughs> we're having a yard sale. <laughs> and you know what? You know what the jerk asked me, and I gotta say this quietly because he could hear me. He said, hey, I'm having a yard sale Sunday. So make sure you move your car. He didn't even invite me to it. He just said, make sure you move your car for two days for my, my block party yard sale. You kidding me? Not like, hey, you want, do you want to sell some stuff in the yard sale right outside your apartment? Nope. <laughs> it's, it's like, ironically, Bob. Bob, quote unquote. Yeah, Chrono, I'm getting to it, man. Chill out. This, this in that scene in Earthbound when you're really far away. I always thought they looked alike. Every time I play this game, I spend forever in the fair. Because I'm kind of confused about what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, man. When I was a kid, I would bet on this all day. I was just like, cat, put all my money on the cat. We're going cat. And then I'd run with them, too. Like, they'd be running and I'd be running, too. And I think to myself, I wish I could enter. I'd own these guys. I'd own them hard. But we don't have any money. That's Melchior. Hey, Melchior. I'll buy something from Melchior, the swordsmith. Sure. Oh, I read the numbers wrong. Should I buy it? No, we don't need to buy something right now. <laughs> I live on the continent to the east. Uh, come see me sometime. I like how you guys are just jumping to the conclusion of a bagel cam. Hi. Ouch, that hurt. Now the trick here is you gotta check on her first. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Uh-oh, my pendant. No, see, so got, we gotta talk to her first. Oh no, don't tell me I lost it. That's how royalty talks, by the way. Oh, thank goodness, my pendant. It has a lot of sentimental value. No, I don't want to screw it up. I don't know, I'm going to jail anyway. May I have it back? I came to see the festival. You live in this town, don't you? I feel a little out of place here. Would you mind if I walked around with you for a while? Sure. You're a true gentleman. Yeah. Oh, by the way, my name is, uh... The Hamper Stand. <laughs> Oh goodness, how does this work? I think that's how you do it. I don't know. That's it. Oh wait, can I work at a colon? No, that's for later. We'll save the colon. I'm sure we'll need that colon later. I don't want to late. Oh, can we draw little faces? I 
I, I'm looking for other characters that would make a good face. Would this help? Now it's like a little chicken. <laughs> what do we call her? I can't even refer to her as that. That does look a little sexual. Oh wait, I didn't realize there were... Nope, that's gonna end up bad. Let's just get out of there. We're not drawing anything. <laughs> Calling our hamper stand. <laughs> Look how bad that looks! <laughs> it's like... It's like a ridiculous letter 3. Or a letter 8 they gave up on. With a thing on the end. Um, hamper stand. And your... Bagel! What a nice name. Pleased to meet you. Now lead on. Bob. <laughs> Wait, this girl lost her cat. Wah! Where's my cat? Alright, we gotta find the cat. Oh. Man, I am solving mysteries. We're not eating the lunch either. Okay, I got the cat. I think. Wait, what? The hell did he just go? I don't want to do that. I don't want to fight him. He's a jerk. Get this cat again. Don't scare him this time. Come on, cat. Get out of here, old man. Don't eat the food. Oh my god, pathing! Let's go, kitten. Oh yeah, that's how all kids sound in RPGs. That's how all of them sound. God, the cat is so slow. You can't even- I can walk through her, can't walk through the cat. Get over here, cat. You brought back my cat! Thank you! You're so sweet, Bugle. Alright. I just solved two problems in this game. They're still setting up. Why don't you come back in a while? I hate fairs! Say, do you know the latest gossip? No. Just between us, I heard that the king is distressed over his tomboy of a daughter. Just once, I would like to see how wild she really is. She is neither a tomboy nor wild throughout this game. That's... She's such a tomboy the way she wears that dress. What? Is it a dress? Is she wearing baggy pants? I don't know what she's wearing. No, we've already named her Hamper Stand. What's the trigger? Oh, Jurassic Rhythm. She's wearing baggy pants. I guess that's kind of tomboyish. Stay a while and listen. What do you want me to do? Oh, goodness. Do I leave and come back? Is it one of those? Arik! I'll have you know I beat that game. Oh my goodness. Talk to Melchior. Good call. Thank you. We're gonna play this game efficiently. Get through it. All these characters to talk to? Superfluous. No time. Nah, you're not him. You're just another old guy. I'll buy something for Melchior the swordsmith. No. Oh, by the way, could you talk to that young lady into selling her pendant? No. Shut it, Melchior. Not your errand boy. I own all the Final Fantasy games for the original Game Boy, even though one was technically the prequel to Secret of Mana. Oh, or do I have to say yes? Yo, hey Rasky, right? How you doing? God. No. I'll try. Go, cat! Go! Who's talking? I think it's him. Oh my, it's the pendant! Uh, sorry, but I can't buy that. It's far too special. Keep it safe. Okay. So we had to make it... Okay. We need to figure out that the pendant's special. Ugh. Well, now what? I don't want to play their games. I'm not good at them. That one where you gotta drink all the soda? That one's... Ridiculous. I don't like going there. That's too spooky for me. The race is on. Be quiet and watch. 
We need to fight the rapping robot. Do I? I can fight the rapping robot, I guess. Teach me how to fight, right? Oh, yeah, because the game's got to show me how to play an RPG. 